Hello children. Welcome to our numerous lesson today. This lesson was produced by Rwanda Education Board with support from UNICEF. My name is Teacher John. This lesson is from Primary 6, Mathematics, Unit 1. Dear adults, we still encourage you to support the children during this radio learning program. Dear children, I hope you already have your notebook and a pen. Now, let us review what we learned in the previous lesson. Dear children, what did we learn in our previous numerous lesson? Very good. In our previous numerous lesson, we learned about rounding of whole numbers to the nearest ten thousands and hundred thousands. We learned that to round off to the nearest ten thousand and hundred thousands, we look at the digit to the right. If the digit is greater or equal to five, we round up. That means we add one to the digit in the ten thousands and a hundred thousands position. And all digits to the right become zero. I repeat, to round off to the nearest ten thousand and hundred thousands, we look at the digit to the right. If the digit is greater or equal to five, we round up. That means we add one to the digit in the ten thousands and hundred thousands position respectively. And all the digits to the right become zero. If the digit to the right of the position to be rounded off to is less than 5, we round down. That means the digit in that position, I mean 10,000s or 100,000s, doesn't change. And the digits to the right of the position to be rounded down to becomes 0. Dear friends, let us check the answers for your homework in the previous lesson. The number 4,378,581 rounded off to the nearest 10,000 is 4,380,000. Dear and the number 4,378,581 rounded off to the 100,000s becomes Four millions, four hundred thousands. I also gave you another number, two millions, three hundred fourteen thousand, three hundred ten, and you are to round it off to the nearest ten thousands and a hundred thousands. Let us check our answers. The number two millions, three hundred fourteen thousand, three hundred and ten. Rounded off to the nearest ten thousands becomes two millions three hundred ten thousands. The same number rounded off to the nearest hundred thousands becomes two millions three hundred thousands. Very good, dear children. I hope you all tried out this homework. Well done. In today's lesson, we will learn about rounding off whole numbers to the nearest millions. But first, let us have a short break. We will be back shortly. Come along and play with us. Welcome back, dear children. Like I said before the break, in today's lesson, we will learn about rounding off whole numbers to the nearest millions. Do you know a million children? I know you do. We learned about writing numbers up to the millions. So in today's lesson, we will learn about rounding off whole numbers to the nearest millions. But first, we will have a warm-up. Our warm-up is a rounding off song we had in our previous lessons. Make any movement you'd like while we sing this song. Are you ready, children? Okay, let's go. 
underline the digit. Look on the right. If it's a five or more, add one more. If it's a four or lower, just ignore. Wonderful. Let's do it one more time, dear children. Are you already standing up? Great. Let's go. Underline the digit. Look on the right. If it's a five or more, add one more. If it's a four or lower, just ignore. Wonderful. I hope you enjoyed it. Dear friends, remember rounding off to the nearest whole number requires us to remember our place values. And what is a place value, friends? Very good. A place value is what tells us the value of a digit in a number based on the location of the digit. The place values include ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, millions, as written from the right to the left. In today's lesson, children, we will learn rounding off to the nearest million. How do you think we do it, friends? Very good. To round off to the nearest million, we look at the digit to the right. That means a digit in the 100,000 position. If the digit is greater or equal to 5, we round up. That means we add 1 to the digit in the millions position. And all the digits to the right become 0. If the digit to the 100 position is less than 5, we round down. That means the digit in the millions position doesn't change and all the digits to the right of the millions position become 0. I repeat, to round off to the nearest million, we look at the digit to the right. That means a digit in the 100,000 position. If the digit is greater or equal to 5, we round up. That means we add 1 to the digit in the millions position. And all the digits to the right become 0. If the digit to the 100 position is less than 5, we round down. That means the digit in the millions position doesn't change and all the digits to the right of the millions position become zero. We will have examples after this short break. Come along and play with us. Welcome back, dear children. Now let us have our first example. Round off the number three millions. 967,686 to the nearest million. The number is 3967686. Dear friends, which digit do we have in the million position? Which digit do we have in the millions position? Very good. We have digit 3 in the millions position. Looking to the right of the millions position, there is digit 9. And digit 9 is in the 100,000 position. But friends, digit 9 is greater than 5, therefore we round up. And that means we add 1 to digit 3 in the million position to get 4. Friends, what did we say happens to the rest of the digits on the right of the millions position? Very good. The positions to the right take on digit zero. The positions to the right take on digit zero. So our number 3967686 rounded off to the nearest millions is... Four zero 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 zero. That means our number three millions 
967,686 rounded off to the nearest million is 4 millions. Well done, friends. Let us have our second example. Round off the number 6 millions 235,404 to the nearest millions. Round off the number 6 millions 235,404 to the nearest million. Dear friends, which digit do we have in the millions position? Very good. We have digit 6 in the millions position. Looking to the right of the millions position, there is digit 2 in the hundred thousands position. Digit 2 is less than 5. Therefore, we round down by keeping digit 6 in the millions position as it is. Friends, what else did we say happens to the rest of the digits on the right of the millions position? Very good. When rounding down, all the positions to the right take on digit zero. So our number, 6,235,404, rounded off to the nearest million is 6 millions. In other words, the number 6235404 rounded off to the nearest million is 6000000, 6 millions. Now, friends, let us have a short break. Come along and play with Welcome back, children. Dear children, can you try this out on your own? Round off the number 5,682,311 to the nearest million. Round off the number 5682311 to the nearest million. You have few seconds to do so. I hope you have finished, friends. Let us check our answer. Dear friends, which digit do we have in the millions position? Very good. We have digit 5 in the millions position. Looking to the right of the millions position, there is digit 6 in the hundred thousands position. Digit 6 is greater than 5. Therefore, we round up by adding 1 to digit 5 in the millions position to get 6. Friends, what did we say happens to the rest of the digits on the right of the millions position? Very good. The positions to the right take on digit 0. So our number 5682311 Rounded off to the nearest million is six zero 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 zero. In other words, our number five million six hundred eighty two three hundred and eleven rounded off to the nearest million is six millions. Thank you for trying out, friends. Dear friends, try this out also. Try it out on your own. Round off the number 1,453,420 to the nearest million. Round off the number 1,453,420 to the nearest million. You have few seconds to do so. I hope you have finished, friends. Let us check our answer. Dear friends, which digit do we have in the millions position? Very good. We have digit 1 in the millions position. Looking to the right of the millions position, there is digit 4 in the hundred thousands position. 
Digit 4 is less than 5. Therefore, what do we do, friends? Perfect. We round down by keeping the digit in the millions position as it is. We are keeping digit 1 the way it is. And then all the digits on the right hand side take on digit 0. This gives our number 1,453,420 rounded off to the nearest million as 1 million. Thank you for trying out that also, dear friends. Before we end our lesson, let us review what we have learned today. What have you learned today, dear children? Perfect. We learned about rounding off to the nearest million. We have learned that we round up by adding one in case the digit to the right of the million position is greater or equal to five. And we learned that we round down by keeping the digit in the millions position as it is if the digit to the right is less than 5. In both cases, each of the positions to the right of the millions position take on digit 0 after rounding up or rounding down. For your homework, friends, round off the following numbers to the nearest millions. The numbers are 3,512,000 and the second number is 8,135,212. The first number is 3,512,000 and the second number is 8,135,212. That is it for today. Thank you for participating. Remember to join us again for our next numeracy lesson. Bye-bye. Goodbye, 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 teacher. Goodbye, children. See you next time. Goodbye, 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 teacher. Goodbye, children. See you next time.